Hi guys and welcome back to my channel and to this video. This video is going to be a new project plan intro and I'm so excited about it. I have recently talked myself into going cruelty free and just stopped buying non cruelty free products. The remaining stuff in my collection that are cruelty free I'm just going to try to use up and I have already spent my money on it so I just want to use it and enjoy it and so on. I have for the longest time thought about starting a project with non cruelty free products and when Sarah she mentioned her idea to the ladies that are in the graveyard for Japan as well in our chat on Instagram I was 100% in this is amazing so she is calling this mission 100% cruelty free pretty pen we are going to end this project when we don't have any cruelty free products in our collection at least Sarah is and I think I am too because again I want to go cruelty free so this is makeup and beauty I'm going to start out with five makeup products and maybe as I am finishing up stuff I can think about a beauty item or a perfume or something we're going to work on five products at a time and again doesn't matter if it is makeup or beauty or whatever the status is just going to be non cruelty free when you finish up a product you roll another in and when you finish the original five you can switch all of them out if you want to and just make it a little bit more interesting to yourself i hope it all makes sense and if you have any questions Leave them down below in the comments and I will answer them to as good as I can. <laughs> and I will have all the ladies linked down below. Sorry, let's get into the products. Let's just take the primer first, shall we? This is the Max Factor Face Finity All Day Primer. I'm so sad this is not cruelty free because this is my favorite primer of all time. I have this is my second bottle. I I have a hard time saying goodbye to this and that I can't buy it again, but I will for sure miss this when it's gone. It is down to here, so I am about halfway finished with this. So I think this will last me over the summer period and then I can change it up with another product. Which makes me sad and excited at the same time. The second product is a BB cream from Maybelline. This is the Pure BB Mineral BB Super Color. I bought this in Japan, so I haven't seen it before, or at least not here in Denmark. But again, I really liked wearing this in Japan, so I thought this was going to be a nice one over the summer. It is a little bit of a darker BB cream than what I am now. So when I get a little bit of a tan, this will be very, very nice to use. Again, I have used it for like a week or something, so I can't really do anything about it, but I am about... Here. Let's take this one. This is the Maybelline Color 2 24 hour cream eyeshadow in Creme de Nude. I am going to work on these because I want them gone. And this is just a basic pale nude kind of, yeah it is yellow tone for sure. So this is going to be a nice base for my eyeshadows. I mostly use these with my fingers or a brush. They go faster with a brush for sure. So I think that is what I'm going to do. Then the last two products are lip products. The first one is a lip balm from Yves Rosé. It is with the raspberry scent or flavor, whatever. This is everything that I have left. I use this every single morning when I apply my makeup as the first layer for my lip routine or whatever you want to call it. So this is a red raspberry tinted lip balm. Then we have the Maybelline lipstick in tantalizing taupe. It is from the Color Sensational lipstick line and it is the really nude one that I have. I had this in a project last year for the lip service and now I want to finish it. So I think this will going it is going to be easy because there is not that much in it and I can wear this with everything that I'm panning. Every color and everything and I can layer it on top of other lipsticks. So I think that would be a great one. So yeah, that is everything for this project basically. I thought it was going to be longer. 
we're going to start it today the 6th of june and then we're going to end it when we want to and when we're going to get sick of it or when we are 100 percent quota free i'm so excited to take part of this project plan because this is something that i'm really excited about recently about going quota free so this is kind of the start of my journey to going quota free which is really really amazing i'm just really excited to be doing it with other ladies so i'm not all alone by myself so please check out the other ladies down below i will have a playlist where we are going to put all of our videos into so you can binge watch us all and until my next video please take care and do subscribe to my channel if you haven't already i would love to have you here with all the other pretty pants that i am doing but yeah until my next video take care